you know how crazy it is that they have to put it on the street so they know where they're talking about? On Monday, October 9th, the deadliest wildfire in California made its way through Sonoma County. The Tubbs fire ravages the city of Santa Rosa, destroying over 7,500 buildings. The estimated damage as of now is $1.2 billion. There have been 22 fatalities within Santa Rosa as well. The winds that night reached up to 45 miles per hour and made the fire near impossible to contain. Joey Peterson is a resident of Santa Rosa who recently lost his house in the Tubbs fire. He walks through Coffee Park now for the first time since that night. It's like a war zone. It's <laughs> This is this is crazy. Joey returns to his home to try to find anything that may be left. But to say this is my house, to say... My sisters were here yesterday. They went digging for a bit for my mom's jewelry. But to say like my car and stuff... But to say we... we uh sifted through that and found my mom's six carat uh, her mom's six carat wedding ring everything like my room my bed frame because my bed my head was right here all the time like it just doesn't make sense crazy to say the mat somewhat made it to say that all the black was our front door mat or to say we t we when we first came back we picked through a few bricks and took them with us this was like a video game rack because i was love video games and movies where was it yeah this was like the hallway i ran down the hallway and turned left to the garage and sh it was just way too hot crock pot like crazy but to say this was like with a pantry to say like there's so much glass under this from all my wine to say like this this is part of a wine bottle but to say this is my playstation i left it here playstation 4 like Just material things that can be replaced, but still. While many residents of Santa Rosa have lost almost everything, the city plans to come back stronger than before and rebuild again. In Santa Rosa, I'm John Garman for State of Events.